Hey guys, this is Issues with Toddy One Skip. I am Toddy One Skip. Welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for allowing me to be part of your day. Guys, I don't know what happened to my microphone. So, guys, anyway, thank you so much for allowing me to be part of your day, breakfast, lunch, or dinner. It doesn't matter to me as long as we're spending some time together. I'm so appreciative. Whether it be at 1.5 speed, no higher, please. I really do appreciate it, guys. Guys, Gypsy Rose Blanchard, why is she on a... I don't know, superstar tour. She's on like a red carpet tour of Los Angeles where there's cameras in her face. She's calling for those cameras, by the way. Somebody's calling up this, uh, like a TMZ type place that's actually selling, what's it called, Backgrid or something like that. They're being called, Backgrid is being called to these places to take pictures of Gypsy Rose to make her feel all important and to make her think like she's a superstar. Is she a superstar? No, she's not. What is she famous for? Oh, eight and a half years for unaliving her mom and people call her a what? Victim and survivor? No, 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 no. No, she's not. She's master manipulator. See, because we've heard the story over and over and over again, many different ways, as you know, from Gypsy's own mouth, as you know. So facts are facts. She just has a really bad memory and she can't tell the truth. So, you know, we heard her say, well, you know, I took a BB, G-U-N, and I unloaded it on my mom, and, but I didn't leave then. I just stayed longer. Why didn't she leave then? Her mom tells her to leave. Even Gypsy's the one that says, my mom told me to leave. Why didn't you leave then? G uh, Dee Dee was obese and very ill towards the end of her life. Why didn't Gypsy leave then? There is no signs of any restraints in the house. Why didn't Gypsy leave then? Gypsy didn't leave then because Gypsy didn't want to. Gypsy left the way she wanted to leave. So while Gypsy's on this tour of God knows what, she actually looks really nice. So who's ever dressing her, that's really done well. But she's walking around like, like, there's a reason for her being there. And what is it? What is it? It's because she's doing life after lockup. That's her claim to fame. That she is like, what is, what is that? It's like a wood chipper with the wood coming in and then all the particles going behind you. So there's Ryan, there's Nick. Ken's on the thing. You're coming, Ken. So... She just doesn't know how to act responsible and she's on a tour. She's on some sort of like she's an influencer. What is she influencing? Where is she the role model that you want your children to be? What has she done besides find a way to manipulate and use people? that she doesn't have any more use for, and then she discards in any way, shape, or form. Why is it that we believe her? I don't believe her. A lot of you don't believe her because we've seen her say the same story many different ways, but yet there are still people that want to believe her. It's almost like she thinks that we are there to say, good job, you, when we are there to watch a train wreck. We are spectators watching you. We can't wait for you to fall. That's the horrible bit of it all. I mean, I don't want to see this woman be successful because look at what she, it's on the back of. It's almost like who wanted to see O.J. Simpson be successful? Who wanted to see Charlie Manson be successful? She's not a survivor. Elizabeth Smart is a survivor. The Frankie kids, survivors. Show me the first thing that restrained Gypsy Rose in any of those crime scene photos. There isn't any. There's, a, there's handcuffs that are fuzzy. Fuzzy handcuffs. There's a drawer that's filled with cosplay costumes because she was kinky she had a computer she had a phone which person captive has that which person captive says go ahead and leave 
Go ahead and leave. Her mom, she said her mom said, go ahead and leave. Which person is a victim that's a survivor that goes ahead and takes a BBGUN, according to her, and then goes back to the house? And she was brainwashed? She wasn't brainwashed. She brainwashed people, but she wasn't brainwashed. The thing that gets me about Gypsy Rose, honestly, is that there's younger people that think she's cool. <laughs> That's the thing that gets me, that she really got away with M-U-R-D-E-R, -E and people are looking at her like, like, like she's some sort of hero. But she's not. And the real heroes and the real victims, this is a spit in their face, in my opinion. And she's on tour. Most people that have a horrible life like that, they do. They, they write a book. They make enough money to keep their life away from everybody else. They go to therapy. It, it becomes more deep. Gypsy is all surface. Surface, there's nothing more to her. It, it's, it's terrible. And yet we're here watching it as she's walking down the Hall of Fame, the Walk of Fame in Hollywood where all the stars are. It's a little busy for her there. I don't know if she thinks she should have it by herself. I know she wants to go to the Planet of the Apes, you know, to the premiere of there. Why? Why would they let you do that, Gypsy? You had a bunch of benefits. You had a bunch of benefits when you played sick. And I think those people want to know, when are you going to pay it back? Why don't you donate money so that some kid in a, real, in a wheelchair that really needs that wheelchair, that bucket list that you took from and make some kids' dreams come true because in actuality they might not be here another year. Why don't you do something like that, Gypsy Rose Blanchard? That would show us that you mean what you say. Because we're still waiting for you to be a better person, for you to learn what you did was wrong, for you to grow. We're still waiting. We want to know who has the watch that has that timeline. Because we just, we don't see it. So what is this tour that you're on? What is this thing that you're doing, acting like you never got to go anywhere and how special this is? when you got to do so much more in your lifetime than so many people get to do in their entire lifetimes. Things handed to you, gifted to you, your entitlement. That's the problem. That's the real issue. She gets on people's lives and throws bombs and talks about content creators that call her out. Get in the box and answer some questions because nobody's asking you the real questions. I have some real questions. Why did you feel that that was the only way to leave? Why didn't you get up? You had the gall to do this. Why didn't you have the gall to do that? Guys, this is Issues with Toddy One Skip. I am Toddy One Skip, and you're not. Do you remember that, Chevy Chase? And you're not. Guys, that's showing my age. Guys, don't forget, I, first of all, I really appreciate you guys. This was, you know, seriously, these are kind of fun, but you got to sit back and say, really, what's going on? Like, why is this woman getting all the attention? I am going to watch that June 3rd show. Because, I mean, I just, mm, it's a guilty pleasure now. You got me into it. It's your fault. <laughs> Guys, please like, subscribe, and share. Only half of you are subscribed. It doesn't cost anything. It means a lot to me. I promise if you don't like us, we'll let you leave. We don't make you stay, but we're glad if you do. We are not a cult, regardless of what you think you heard. Please comment. I'm in the comments. Be better today than you were yesterday. Not half as good as you'll be tomorrow. Never be Gypsy Rose Blanchard. Always be yourself and always be kind. Thanks, guys.